If you want to create motion graphics products, a lot of late night pizza is required. Because it's the pizzas that you wait at night during countless jobs that gives you the experience that you need to face this challenge. We are talking about pizza and motion graphics, but it could be cheeseburgers and 3D modeling or cupcakes and music composition, well, it applies to a lot of markets. But aren't these video products and service that our clients buy online decreasing our income and harming our market? Think in this way. You, as a creative professional, offer to the market a product that your client will not find ready out there. Is an authentic pizza. And those who consume and pay for a terrific pizza are not the same who buy a frozen pizza at the supermarket. When they invented the frozen pizza, they took a traditional pizza recipe and made it accessible to people that previously was not used to consume pizza as often. But the old good taste pizza is still out there. Why don't you take that recipe that only you can do and make it accessible to a larger number of customers? It's a win-win. Well, I like to think in two categories in which you can sell motion graphics products. Active productization and passive productization. These categories don't really exist, I just created, but I'm pretty sure that you will understand what I mean. Active productization is those where you need to actively work on them to be paid. You can find examples of active productization on sites like Upwork, Fiverr, among others. You take a skill that you have, for example, animating logo review and format it in a specific way. Your clients will know what they will get and how much they will pay. You, on the other hand, will probably know how long it takes to get the job done. It's like ordering a pizza online at Domino's or a similar app. You choose the size of the pizza and the flavors and if you want you still can get some extra customizations for example here in brazil people like corn in the pizza you can do this with logo review video editing rotoscopy chroma key 3d modeling there are a lot of opportunities i have no experience in this kind of productization so i want to talk to you about passive productization you create the product once and it will be available to sell in the internet and you will not be required to work actively on it to make money. This product can be a template for After Effects, pre-rendered footage as backgrounds or particles, music and sound effects and the list goes on. Kega Pizza! Customers will buy it as it is, and if they want, they will have to customize it on their own. The author will have no relation with the product anymore, just for support if it's required. You can sell on your own by creating a website or something, but it will be very difficult for you to get enough traffic of people looking for this kind of product and that's why exists the marketplace or the supermarkets in the case of frozen pizzas. These websites will be happy to receive your product if it reach the required quality standard and for that they will charge a commission over the sales. Your products will be like pizzas in the supermarket. The customer will buy it as it is and if they want, they can customize it on their own. Marketplace usually work in two categories, subscription or one by one product sale. By subscription, it's like an all-you-can-eat pizza buffet. The customer pay once, usually monthly, 
and then he can eat or download as many assets as he wants. There is a formula to share the earnings between the authors and the marketplace. Each marketplace has its own, but usually this category rewards those who have a large amount of products because these calculations usually rewards who had more downloads. So your complexity or quality of your products don't count so much. Examples of this kind of marketplace are Inveto Elements, Motion Array and Storyblocks. In this case, the marketplace receives a commission for each product sold. These commissions usually vary accordingly with the total of sales that an author has made over time. Some examples of this kind of marketplace are Pun5, Rocket Stock, Turbo Squid, if you are a 3D modeler, and Video Hive. To be honest, I have experience with Video Hive only. I had rare experience on the other platforms, but I intend to learn more about them in the future and share what I discovered. Speaking of Video Hive, there are basically four categories that you can explore. Templates, and it can be Adobe After Effects, Premiere Pro, and Apple Motion Projects. Motion Graphics, whenever you create something and sell it as a movie file with or without transparency, they call it motion graphics. It's a little weird, but it's how they call this kind of footage. Stock footage is when you grab a camera, record something and put this scene to sell on the marketplace. Add-ons are the presets for Premiere Pro and After Effects and the scripts for After Effects. The price of your product is defined from two slices. The first is your slice, is how much you want to charge for your product. The marketplace gives you a suggestion, but at the end, you choose how much you want to charge. Let's say that we are going to create a template for After Effects and we are going to charge $44 for it. The second slice is the commission that the buyer will pay to the marketplace when get your product. This varies accordingly with the type of product. For motion graphics and stop footage, it's $3, and for After Effects templates, $6. There will be also a commission for the marketplace from your slice. If you are exclusive author, this fee varies accordingly with the total of sales already made. For those who already had made more than $75,000, thousand dollars this hate is 12 and a half percent if it's your case in this product you will earn 38 and 50 cents or 77 percent of the total amount of the price if you are an exclusive author but just start selling now your rate is 37 and 50 percent in this case you will earn 27 and 50 cent it is 55% of the total amount of the product. If you are a non-exclusive author, in other words, you sell the same product on VideoHive and in other websites, then your rate is 45%. So in this case, you will earn $24.20, 48% of the total of this product. If your country does not have a special trade treaty with the United States, you may have to pay up to 30% of the price that you set it to your product. But just when the sale is to a US citizen, this tax may vary accordingly with your country. A lot of people ask me if it really works to host products on marketplace since the commission at the beginning are so high. But think with me, if you want to sell it by yourself on your website, the amount of traffic that you need of people that want the product that you are selling is too high and to get this traffic you will probably have to spend a lot with online advertisement probably more than the commission that you pay to the marketplace 
VideoHive is probably the most popular website for selling templates for After Effects and also one of the oldest too. But the real reason why I choose it is because it is the most open and transparent. It shows you information that can be very inspiring, for example, date of creation and amount of sales of each product. It gives you a clue about the total of sales that each author made. This guy made more than $750,000 in sales. When you cross this information, it's easy to understand the potential of a product. This helps you to understand what type of product you should expand your time producing. I can't fight this. The choose of the marketplace to sell your motion graphic products will depend on how you want to sell them, if you want to work actively on them or if you want to passively sell them. It will also depend on the quality that you can deliver on your work. For example, I already have a product that was rejected on the video hive but then I posted it on the Pond5 and they accept it. So different marketplace has different standards of quality. Oh, I gotta stay away, but you won't let me no In the next video, I will show you a step-by-step -step about creating your profile to sell products on VideoHive. There are some little secrets there that I want to show you. Thank you very much for watching and bye bye!